guys, Mac Tutorials 101. Today I'm gonna show you what is in my dock. Okay, so first there are gonna be some obvious things, and then there are gonna be some not so obvious things. Okay, here we go. First, I have Finder, which is like the start menu on the Windows. Okay, um, that's like this right here. Finder finds anything on your Mac. Dashboard, which is um, this pops up, and um, so what I have is calculator, Google, time, um, translator, weather, stickies, wall saver, Rubik's cube, um, movies, calendar, and secret folder. Okay. Um, mail. Um, what I use to check my mail. Firefox is one of the good web browsers I use. Not too bad. Safari is my is my main browser. Um, but a lot of the times I recommend Firefox, but I still like to use Safari more. Um, so I just book um, self-explanatory. I calendar I um, mark events on there on my calendar. iTunes. If you don't know what that is, then I think you might have a little problem. But, um, yeah, I keep all my music on that. <laughs> Front row, um, that's like a media player that just comes with your Mac, a standard Mac. Transmission is a torrent download, or it downloads torrent for you, basically. Dictionary, um, helps you search words. System preferences, um, it let you change your um, settings on your Mac. Um, TV, um, TV networks is what it's called. Um, yeah, I use that a lot sometimes. It's pretty cool for watching TV. <laughs> iMovie HD. I use this all the time to edit my videos. Um, ScreenFlow is what I'm currently using right now. It's what I use to record the screen. Radium is like ScreenFlow, except ScreenFlow has more options, I'd say. Same thing with I Show You, it's, it doesn't have as many options as ScreenFlow. I definitely recommend ScreenFlow, though. Okay, um, QuickTime Player, um, plays media files, um, MP4 files, stuff like that. VLC, VLC is like the pro version of QuickTime, except it's free. <coughs> Sorry, I'm a little sick today. Um, I eat brains. This is for iTunes. It um does it searches the albums and the name and the artist of the songs for you, so you don't have to do that. So you don't have to do that yourself. I use it a lot. It's really cool. Yahoo Messenger is what I use to um talk to my friends with. Um. Photo booth is a fun little picture thing that um, I think is really cool. Um, yeah, that's what I do to edit some of my, to, to just take funny little pictures. <coughs> Google Earth, that is really cool. I use that all the time to browse um, places around the world. Really fun to do. Comic Life, I'm actually gonna open this one up. This is where you can make standard comics like here, um, this is it. Um, what you do is you select the template. Let's say you just want this template. Grab that. You could take pictures, like stuff like that. I'll just take this right here. And then you put pictures. You can resize pictures and stuff. Put them in there, like that. And um. And then you can put text. Um. Oh no. Um, resize it and stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's a really cool program. I use that a lot to make funny little comics. <laughs> okay. Click that. Get tube. Um, that is an application that lets you download YouTube videos. Uh, but you have to have Firefox or Safari to use this. Sorry about the people who have Internet Explorer, you cannot use this. 
Um, I recommend downloading Safari. I think it's better. Light icon. Now this is what I use to change my finder icon. Um, see, I changed my finder icon to red. Yeah, it's an it's an, a cool application. I'm actually gonna open it up. I'll open. <coughs> Wait for that to load. Takes a little bit, and then here, um. Now you could view folders, devices, doc, others. Um, I clicked on doc and went to a website um, and downloaded icons. This is actually, I put a tutorial of, on this video, so um, for this. So just check out my other videos if you wanna see the tutorial on this. GIMP is like Photoshop, really cool. Um, app delete, I use this to delete every single one of my apps that I don't like. It uninstalls every single thing you say on that for that app for that app. I alert you. This is really, really cool. I use it so that my little sister doesn't snoop on my um onto my Mac. It's um well you arm the system and then it whenever someone comes up to it and like moves the mouse, it automatically makes a really loud alarms alarm sound and takes a picture of the person. So it's really cool. And then so that's how I know who went onto my computer. I think it's really neat. I definitely recommend it. SketchUp, this is by Google. It is um let you do 3D pictures. Um so yeah. Or animation sorry. Image to icons lets you make um but you change, convert pictures to icon format. Really neat. I use that for my for my folders. DocX. That lets you change the design of your doc. For example, if you look at my doc, my doc is like more like ice. Um, the color of ice. It's not like the old color. I think it's really really neat. It's free download. I really recommend it. Oh, that's just my, um, that's just my internet. I can close that. I can close that. I don't need that. And then I have trash. Um, so yeah, that is what is in my dock for 2009. Thank you for watching, everybody. Remember to subscribe, rate, and comment. Thanks. See ya.